I think it's funny that I'm ending the semester this way, seeing as I started by telling the story about how I used to be very introverted and then I completely changed that to kind of saying yes to every opportunity that presented itself to me. And now I get to tell this story. Sometimes we get caught up living such fast, busy lives that we forget about the passions that drive us in the first place. We're conditioned to set our dreams on the back burner by the idea that if we stop for a second, they won't become a reality. Sometimes we need the world to stop in order for us to start again. I would say that my quarantine story, pandemic story is different from everyone else's, or at least what I've come to realize. In quarantine, I've had a positive experience, a kind of a rediscovery, if you will, of myself. <laughs> Most importantly, I think I regained my creative side. I kind of put him to the side for a while. I was always such a creative person. I just loved anything creative, coming up with ideas, filming, taking pictures, editing. I always wanted to start a podcast. That was one of my passion projects or goals that I had. And I was able to find the time to do the research, gather up some of my friends, gather some equipment and finally society and rap was born hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of society and rap i hope that everyone is doing well well actually quarantine for me was actually kind of a positive experience it allowed me to slow down and um actually like pick things back up that I had kind of left behind. It was kind of like a, a reset, if you will. All I can say is that I'm very grateful for this time.